2018 Houston Auto Show. My name is Kent Burrow, I'm Charlie's home manager right here in Houston, and uh, I'm going to share with you and preview for you the 2019 Silverado LT Trail Boss. All right, the first thing that I would like to tell you about our all-new 2019 Silverado is that we have eight trim levels. We have three trim levels that fall in what we call the high-value category. We also have three trim levels that fall in the high-volume category, and then two that fall into what we call the high-feature category. The LT Trail Boss actually falls into uh, what we call our high-volume uh, trim lines. And how do we know a uh, trail boss is a trail boss or what makes it distinctive? So the first thing I would do is I would draw your attention to uh, the gloss uh, grill as well as inserts. We also feature a black bow tie and a painted front bumper. When you see this, you are looking at a trail boss. Powering the trail boss is a 5.3 liter V8 engine, 355 horsepower, 383 foot pounds of torque, and it features our new dynamic fuel management. Now, if you haven't heard about this dynamic fuel management, what it allows you to, uh, what allows the engine to do is to reduce the number of cylinders that are required to power the vehicle based on the driver's input. It has 17 different characteristics or settings that it can adjust to and can actually reduce the power down to a single cylinder if needed in order to get optimum fuel economy. Again, as long as the driver's input uh, allows it to do so. Now for you, uh, those of you over here, I'm actually gonna transition over to this side of the truck because uh, not only is the front end distinctive on the trail boss, but uh, the side view is also very distinctive as well. So I'll just kind of talk uh, from this uh, standpoint. When you look at the side view of the trail boss, the first thing you notice is probably the stance, right? It sits taller. That's because we from the factory actually will uh, build this truck with a two inch lift on it. So a factory two inch lift on the trail boss. Gives us this great look. When we combine that with an 18 inch wheel as well as this Goodyear Duratrack tire, uh, it gives it an additional aggressive look, but also uh, certainly increases the capability uh, of what Trail Boss can do. Uh, we combine Trail Boss with the Z71 package. So Z71 is legendary in Silverado terms. Z71 provides us a locking differential, uh, certainly important if you take this vehicle off-road. Also includes skid plates, so over the uh, oil pan, transfer case provide protection, uh, again, if you're taking this vehicle off-road. Rancho Mono 2 shocks, so we've got uh, control of the balance of the vehicle uh, as we're taking it. Uh, additionally, when you look at the side of the vehicle, you will probably notice that we have pushed the wheels out. So nearly four inches, we moved the, the rearward uh, aft and the frontward uh, forward in order to uh, lengthen the wheelbase on the vehicle. Uh, what that does for us, in addition to giving this truck capability to descend hills, climb out of ravines, is to stretch the truck, the cab of the truck. So we increase the size of the truck by nearly four inches due to us extending the length of the wheelbase of the vehicle. Uh, once you open the door and look in at the uh, front of the vehicle, uh, you will see, first of all, from a, a technology standpoint, we've, we've enhanced the uh, trail boss with our Chevrolet Infotainment 3 system, so it's got the latest uh, from an infotainment standpoint. Uh, also includes 4G LTE. Uh, the truck also includes uh, compatibility with Apple CarPlay Android Auto, which gives you a true uh, hands-free uh, driving experience. So audio text as well as hands-free calling. Additionally, when you look inside the vehicle, you see a number of safety features that we've installed. So uh, from the front, we've got additional cameras. On the tailgate, we've got additional cameras. So uh, we can uh, look at lane keep assist as far as one of the safety features we have. Cross traffic alert, so if vehicles are moving behind the vehicle. Uh, we also have alerts back there for that. Uh, one of the, the, the more important things probably to a real truck owner is the uh, amount of storage that we've got. So we've got this patented two uh, glove box inside the vehicle. We have center console, whether it's bed seat or bucket. 
Uh, you've got center console storage available to you, uh, door pockets, but also when you look at uh, the back of the truck, uh, we've got the industry's first uh, center uh, seat storage. So uh, within uh, each of our rear seats, the outboard positions, you've got the ability to store items in the seat backs as well. So think about some items that you may need that you don't use frequently, uh, it would be a great place uh, to store those. As I move to the back of the vehicle, uh, we call this the business end, right? So this is a pickup truck. This is where all the work gets done. Uh, the first thing that I would tell you is that we do have power release uh, tailgate available on this. Um, uh, so it gives you the, the flexibility and freedom to release the tailgate. Uh, on certain trim levels, we also have a uh, power up and down uh, tailgate, first in the industry to offer that on a full-size pickup truck. Now, when we talk about the bed, we feel it's the most functional bed that we've ever offered in a Silverado pickup truck. Uh, it's the DuraBed, uh, so we branded it the DuraBed. Uh, we have basically stretched the sides of this truck, uh, sides of the bed, all the way up to the bed sides, nearly seven inches. So we have, we actually offer uh, industry best charter capacity as far as uh, our short bed as well as our long bed pickup truck. In addition to that, we still have a functional things such as two-tier uh, load and storage in the back. We have uh, a total of 12 fixed uh, attachment points in the back of the truck. Each of those, a single point, can hold up to 500 pounds. We also have flexibility in the back where we have nine additional storage attachments that can be uh, placed throughout uh, the back of the truck. Uh, one of the additional features considering the redesign of the old Silverado is if you look at this bed, and it's made of uh, high strength steel, so it's still uh, steel bed. But we've actually reduced the weight of the overall Silverado by 485 pounds. And we've done that through the use of high strength steel as well as aluminum. So any of our hinge panels actually are made of aluminum. Any fixed are actually made of steel or high strength steel. Uh, the Trail Boss uh, and its siblings, all the other Silverado models as well, uh, have gone through rigorous testing. In total, we have put over 7 million miles of testing on the Silverado before we release it to the public. Uh, that uh, enables us to maintain our status as the longest lasting, most dependable truck uh, on the road. Uh, and with that, uh, that is the introduction to the all new Trail Boss. If anyone has any questions, please let me know. Uh, I would certainly like to, at this point though, uh, direct you over to the Chevrolet Bolt EV uh, where we have an additional uh, presentation uh, that will take place in just a few moments. Thank you.